So we've learned how to factor polynomials. So we have to factor the top and bottom. So you should be good at factoring by now. And if you aren't, you really need to go back and practice that in my lessons on that. So the way we do it is we say we have an x squared term. So it's got to be an x times an x. And then we have a 6. Now we have choices. We can say 1 times 6 is 6. Or we can say 2 times 3 is 6. So I'm going to say 2 times 3 is 6. And then you try to figure out what the signs are. Now the only way that it works is negative times negative. In the denominator, again, you factor. You have an x squared, so the leading terms are x. Now with 12, I have lots of choices. I have 1 times 12 over here. I could do 2 times 6. But when you work through all the possibilities, the only one that really works is 3 times 4. And for the signs, what really works is negative times negative. And so then you can see immediately that you can uh, divide top and bottom by x minus 3. And so then the final answer will be on the top x minus 2, on the bottom x minus 4. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.